best in the world Can I take a picture, modify it on my wall Make I take it to Nigeria, Lagos straight to Kenya See the gift of nature, we go make you love adventure, yeah Yeah, you know it's best in the world Can I take a picture, modify it on my wall Make I take it to Nigeria, Lagos straight to Kenya See the gift of nature, we go make you love adventure, yeah Were you right in YouTube? How is everybody doing y'all? Yeah, I am back with the juice and you already know I got the spiritual tea for your first. So tap me, friend. Tap in, friend. This she got is cute, Ella. Okay, that's period. And if you haven't already subscribed, go ahead and smack that subscribe button. Don't forget the alert icon and go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up. Okay, that's Period. So y'all, we keep ready to get into the business. Okay, it's just been listen. The tea is hot. Okay, it's been so much just, just, just been been pouring out in the situation. I know somebody told me that Cali and um Sway um followed each other and everything like that. So we get ready to get into this read and we finna read motherfucking sway and henry and then we finna read kathy and sway we finna read the whole situation we finna get all up in the business okay that's period we just we that's how we coming okay so let's just go ahead and get into it so i first want to start by showing my gratitude to all spiritual beings who work together with and for me according to my highest good i'm at Extremely grateful for your divine protection and guidance. Okay, that's cute. So, y'all, starting off, I want to read Callie's and Sway's energy, just their general energy, just to see how they feeling right now, what's on their mind, what they going through, you know, that type of thing. So, we're going to read Sway first. So, Spirit, what is Sway's general energy? We got the Six of Pentacles showing up in the reverse here. So, she could be feeling like, um, she could be feeling like she lost something. Like, maybe somebody pulled their energy back from her. Or maybe she's pulling her energy back from somebody. We got that Six of Pentacles. Um, she could be feeling like... um, She could be feeling like something was a slap in the face. Like, I, you know you invest your energy into something that you realize like you shouldn't have. She could be feeling like something was a waste of time. Or she could be feeling like she wasted her time. Wasted her time and her energy. Spirit, what is Sway's general energy right now? So she could be feeling frustrated. She could be having something on her mind. Don't know how to express it. Somebody could have her blocked. Whoever it is that she wants to communicate with. Like they could have her blocked. Spirit, can we clarify this name of cups? Why do we have this name of cups? going up here i'm seeing the justice card in the reverse so maybe um sway is frustrated she feel like she's going through something that's not fair or maybe somebody is misjudging her and she feel like it's not fair like they're unfairly judging her she could have got a message from somebody like from Kylie or Henry or whoever, like somebody on the outside. She could have read something online and she felt like it was unfair. Or maybe it just wasn't true or it wasn't like correct. Spirit, can we clarify this name of cups? I feel the energy like she wants to say something but don't know how to put it in words. Yeah, see we got the nine of swords showing up here. Like, uh, Sway is stressed out about something. It's a whole lot on her mind. It could have been a lot on her mind for some time now. 
and things could have become like more clear once she saw something or heard something and decided to pull her energy back. This could be somebody she's dealing with. Like maybe they saw something that she did online and they pulled their energy back and maybe she's feeling frustrated and she feel like it's not fair. Like whatever is not true or whatever the case may be. It's kind of like, like, you know, like if, okay, let's say like this is, and this is just an example. Let's say Kylie seen something um in her phone or seen something online about her and Henry. And then she just went ahead and judged her and said, you know what, fuck it, I'm going to pull back my energy. Ain't no use in me putting energy into this and wasting my time when you got this type of shit going on. And Sway may feel like, you know what, it's unfair that you judging me by some shit that you seen online or some shit that you seen in my phone when whatever the case may be, like, whatever. And she could be feeling frustrated. Or it could be vice versa. You know, so spirit, what energy is Sway in? What is her general energy? We got the Queen of Wands in the reverse. Like, she's feeling like a little bit discouraged right now. She's not feeling like, like she's not enthused or motivated to move forward. Maybe she feel like her foundation is missing something. Or maybe she feel like her foundation is falling apart. Maybe she lost the attention of somebody and she's not feeling, you know, she's not feeling herself, not feeling attractive. You know how you go through it in a relationship or you go through it with one person and you feel like, like, damn, like, I ain't never going to find love. I keep getting fucked over. And not even necessarily love. Like, I ain't never going to find a business partner, a good business partner, or whatever the case may be. Like, I'm going to keep getting fucked over. Well, I ain't never going to get past everybody talking about me in the media. Like, it's always going to affect my life type shit. We got the four of wands showing up in a reverse and the four of wands is like it speaks on your foundation like so she could be feeling like her foundation is falling apart or it is missing something like i said before i feel like she was dealing with somebody that really turns her on you see that puddle of water right there okay but this card came out in a reverse so maybe this person this is this could be the person that took back their energy Maybe her and this person is not seeing eye to eye. And this is the king of pentacles. Like maybe they decided they wasn't finna be there for her anymore. Or they wasn't gonna take care of her anymore. Or they didn't want the commitment. Because we got the four of ones and the king of pentacles in a reverse. So maybe somebody reneged on a commitment or a relationship with Sway. Or this could be her. Maybe she pulled back her energy. Decided she didn't want to be a part of it anymore. So let's go ahead and read Callie's energy. We done read Sway energy. What's tea spirit? What is what is meant the freaking Callie's energy spirit? What is Callie's general energy? party energy Callie done Callie feel caught up Callie done either caught somebody in a um in some type of situation okay or um or Callie done got caught up Callie is going through a tower moment in her life right now spirit can we clarify this tower 
I'm seeing the devil card in the reverse. I feel like Callie done released some type of toxic energy or a toxic person. Spirit, can we clarify this tower card? What is this tower that Callie is going through, Spirit? I'm seeing an Ace of Cups here. She could be going through a tower moment in her love life. Maybe she got some clarity on something. Something was revealed. She tried, She saw the truth. Look, we have the Four of Swords here. So I feel like Callie, she keep it quiet. Like she just observing right now, seeing how everything is playing out. I feel like something was revealed to her and she probably like, she could have spoke on it or maybe she didn't even speak on it. Like this is something like, you know how like you catch, like you see something in your boyfriend's phone and you don't say nothing about it, but you just pull back, like you fall back. Like you, you pull your energy and you fall back. Like you see the clarity or whatever the case may be, but you don't say nothing like, cause it's nothing to be said. You've seen it. You see everything you need to see. You get what I'm saying? That's period. Or maybe they did talk about it. And maybe she's just moving forward, being quiet, just observing. Just to see what's going to happen next. I feel like Kelly is in this energy of observing things. Like whatever this tower moment is, like she went through it or is going through it. But now she's just watching to see how people react, how things play out. Spirit, what is Kylie's general energy? Yeah, see with the Queen of Swords here, she's trying to move forward smart. Okay, she could be looking over the mistakes that she made in the past, reflecting on those things and trying to make better decisions moving forward. I feel like that devil card in reverse, I feel like that's Callie just embracing the truth about things and releasing whatever does not fit, whatever does not feel right. Even with some of her own bad habits or whatever the case may be, how she handled things. Because she's thinking, she reflecting on the past. And she's trying to figure out how to do things different. How to move forward with her best foot. So she's observing things. She's paying attention to things more now. It could be some things that she swept under the rug in the past. And maybe she realized like she's not going to sweep it under the rug. She's going to pay attention to what the fuck is going on. She's going to pay attention to what the fuck is being said. So we got the four of pentacles in a reverse here. Like Callie was holding back. But I feel like she's releasing that shit now. Like, yeah, like this is a person who used to sweep things on the road, used to keep quiet or whatever, just to avoid conflict. But now she's releasing. Now she's saying she's not holding back anymore. And I feel like she's letting go of what she needs to let go of, too, as well. That Four of Pentacles in a reverse with the Devil card in a reverse. Like, she's letting go of things that she's been holding on to that she didn't need to. Yo, we got the Five of Wands in a reverse here. She's definitely letting go. Whatever was having herself um, in this, like, self-conflict and, and just not you know how you have inner turmoil like you just can't get comfortable like just it's something bothering you like you just something just disrupt your spirit like i feel like she's releasing all that and she could have been arguing with somebody a lot and like she could have put an end to that as well just arguing with people or arguing with one specific person or just even just arguing like trying to fight or um prove herself or explain herself like she's not doing that anymore like i love this for cali that's period girl okay put you first that's on period 
all right so that's their general energy we're gonna go ahead and move um into what's going on between them two so that's that's next let's get into it so y'all i was gonna do the henry situation with this video but i want to do something different i want you guys to put your questions what you specifically want me to ask about um sway and henry situation if they still messing around with each other or whatever the case may be um and i'm gonna pick some of the questions to do in that video in that reading so we're gonna pull a few cards on cali and sway I, first of all, I first of all want to ask, like, did they really unfollow each other? Like, did they really unfollow each other? Because y'all said it, but I don't really know. So before we even move forward in this situation, like, I want to know, did they really follow, unfollow each other? So we got a no and we got the devil thing. So we got the devil card. So I feel like maybe they did unfollow each other, but maybe they still like watching each other like from like spam pages. From the op page. Okay, that's period. So, Spirit, what was, like, what's going on between Cali and Sway? Is this, are they beefing? Like, is this just for publicity? So we got a no card. So it's not for publicity. They really going through something. It's a seven of cups. But I feel like um maybe Callie maybe Callie is coming up out of the illusion. Maybe she's realizing that the situation between her and Sway is toxic with this devil card showing up here as well. So Spirit, did Henry come in between Callie and Sway. Did yeah, Henry come in between Callie and Sway? So we got a guest card, okay, and this is the King, uh, the Knight of Pentacles. I feel like maybe it was a long time coming. Uh, maybe Callie been feeling some type of way about Sway and Henry, but maybe it just came to a head like now. Uh, I feel like maybe Callie maybe seen like a message in between Henry and Sway and maybe it made her feel some type of way Spirit did Callie, Henry and Sway have a threesome did they ever have a threesome y'all look three of cups but we ain't gonna take that Let's, let's go ahead and shuffle. Let's go ahead and shuffle. Spirit, did Henry, did Henry, Callie, and Sway have a threesome? Y'all, we have a yes. That had a motherfucking threesome. Okay. Y'all, let's see. Did they have a threesome? Spirit said yes. Okay. Uh, oh my God. 
I feel like maybe Sway maybe tried to make it like a relationship. Like something regular. Oh my God. Because that little vibe, like it was giving threesome vibes on that video, all three of them. Like it was so random for all three of them to have a um, video together. And y'all know something? When Kylie um, said something to Ali about Henry or whatever the case may be, I feel like maybe she tried to start something like, you get what I'm saying? Because she was already feeling some type of way about Henry, but it was, you know what I'm saying? she was sweeping it under the rug so she finally now speaking up and seeing how she truly feel you get what i'm saying so spirit how is Callie feeling about sway right now And maybe Callie not even realizing, maybe it's not that she's just realizing that the situation she had between her and Sway is toxic, but maybe she's realizing, like coming up out of this illusion and realizing that Sway is connected to Henry in a toxic way, like she's not gonna let go type shit. You get what I'm saying? And maybe she's realizing that, and maybe it took her a while to finally realize that, you know, she's not gonna cut that short or maybe she's trying or maybe she's now realizing you know what sway is trying to do between all three of them with this four of wands here so spirit how does callie feel about sway right now So we got the Queen of Wands. Like, Callie is still attracted to Slay. Like, she still find her sexy. She still, like, you get what I'm saying? Like, ugh. So, Spirit, how does Sway feel about Callie right now? Sway is hurt with the Ten of Swords here. Like, I don't know what the fuck happened, but Sway is hurt. Spirit, can we clarify this Ten of Swords? Why is Sway hurt? Because of, because of this ending with the World card here. Because of the ending. Sway is not at peace with the Temperance card in the reverse here. So Kylie made a decision, even though she's still attracted to Sway or whatever, she still had to make her decision. She still had to put her foot down. You get what I'm saying? So Spirit, is Sway still fooling around with Henry? So we got to know. So we got the Five of Swords too. So the Five of Swords speaks on competition. So maybe it was like, you know, Sway had to choose in between um, Henry and Callie. And maybe she made a decision. But maybe um, Callie didn't believe it or whatever the case may be. But somebody walked away in defeat. You see how this person is walking away right here, left the swords, left everything. Yeah, and this person is standing here with the two swords, like this person won, but this person is walking away in defeat. So I feel like it was something like that, like Sway had, maybe had to choose. And she's not, you know, messing around with Henry right now. Henry had to walk away and take that L. So let's get this straight, y'all. So... Sway chose Henry over her twin sister 
But then she chose Kylie over Henry. Mm, 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 mm. Now that's the real tea right there. Now that's the real tea. That's the real tea. So Spirit, what can we expect to see next? Like, will they reconcile? So I'm seeing the moon card. And the moon, it speaks on things that's hidden. So I feel like there's still more to the story that we don't know. Or maybe Callie doesn't know. It could be more toxic connections or situations that um, Sway have going on that Callie doesn't know about. It's like you, you got your attention on Henry, but that's not the one that you should worry about. <laughs> okay, that's period all right so spirit will will Callie and Sway continue to make videos together will Callie and Sway continue to make videos together So we got a no card, but this is the Knight of um, Swords. So I feel like um, they may not continue to do videos together. like, And that could just be the energy right now. Like maybe they may have to have a conversation with each other um, before they could get in a place to make videos together. But they may make a video like talking to the fans, like um, speaking on the situation. They may be seen arguing back and forth, like video to video back and forth. But, you know, we just got to wait and see, okay? We just got to wait and see. So spirit, y'all know I gotta ask this. So spirit, how does Ali feel about everything? Like, what is on Ali's mind? Like, as she's looking at everything play out, like that's tea. We got the lovers card, so I feel like Ali feel like. <laughs> She think they go together, okay? And she feel like Sway is being two-faced or uh, playing both sides with that Gemini. You see the Gemini symbol right there. So she could feel like, you know, Sway is it's more to it. Like, Sway got some shit going on that she's not saying. And the lovers also speak on choosing between lovers. Choosing between two different lovers or between two different choices as well. So I feel like Allie may be just sitting back and watching her choose, pick and choose, and, um, you know, play both sides or whatever the case may be. Because Sway may not be dealing with Henry now. But Allie may have been watching her deal in between the two of them. And we don't know exactly what Sway said to Henry. So even though they're not fooling around with each other, and even though Henry walked away feeling, um, you know, like defeated or whatever the case may be, we don't know if Sway like completely closed that door or if she just said something to him like you know you know how you could say things like you could close it over but still leave it open a little bit so you could come back if you want to or maybe don't say nothing at all just block the person and you know later on you may go back and say well it's not really nothing like that or whatever the case may be so, Spirit, how does Allie really feel about this whole situation? Let's pull two more cards, y'all. Let's 
so we got the uh ace of one showing up in the reverse she may feel like her sister is being conceited she she may feel like they are wasting their potential or talent like she may feel like sway is not living like doing all that she could really do like she may feel like sway is letting this love situation hold her back from growing She may also feel like Sway is being conceited into thinking that she could keep both of those situations going on. She may even feel like her sister needs to follow her most authentic self, like just come out the closet already. <laughs> she could also feel like it was time wasted. Like her sister is wasting her time. Her time and her potential on Henry, period. Or just the situation. Yeah. So that's all I got for this video. Let me know what you guys are thinking in the comments. And y'all share this video. Share my videos. I'm trying to get my subscribers up so that we can start going live. I feel like we need a live moment so we can talk about this in live time. Okay, that's period. Like real time shit. Okay, so y'all have a great day.